Welcome to today's pronunciation lesson on Extra Stars Academy. Our sounds today are very similar. A and A, as in bed and bad. If you have not subscribed to this channel, please do. And if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you have a comment, if you have any question, place in the comment section and I'll be there to respond. Okay, so our sounds today are A and Ah. These sounds in words like dead and bad are very different because the vowels in the words are different. So we're going to learn how to pronounce the sounds with word examples like I have on the board. What you need to do is to say the sound and the words out loud and exaggerate the sounds until you can consistently produce them. So you listen and watch how I move my mouth. Repeat and practice exactly the way I say it. A is a short sound produced with the tip of the tongue close to the lower front teeth. A. So the tip of your tongue is touching your lower front teeth and the tongue is raised to a position where the jaw is neither open nor closed. Eh, eh. The lips are slightly pulled back and stretched a little bit, just a little bit. Eh, eh, eh. It's a relaxed sound, so you don't have to use much muscle when you're producing the sound. Eh, eh. It is the main sound for letter E. Eh, eh. Dead. Dead, dead, eh, good. Now the second sound is ah. When you're producing the sound, the front part of your tongue is raised with your lips spread, but not very spread, not as spread as e, just a little bit. Ah, ah. And it is the main sound for letter A. So today we are looking at the main sounds for letter E as in E. And the main sound for letter A as in A. A. Let's look at some word examples in minimal pairs. We have E. Don't forget I said you listen, pronounce the words out loud. You must exaggerate the sound so you can produce it very well. And watch the movement of my mouth. E. E. A. A. E. A. E. A. E. A. You find out that when you're producing A, the, the mouth is more open than E. E. A. E. A. Okay, let's look at word examples. And, 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 bed, bed, bad, bad, beg, beg, bag bag men men man man then then than than pen pen pan pan Leg, leg, lag, lag, leg, leg, lag, lag, trick, trick, track, track, pets. Pets, parts, parts. So we've looked at some words with the sounds e and a. Ah. I hope you note the difference in the sounds, and I hope you're saying it out loud because if you don't say it out loud, you won't be able to produce the sound 
Very well. So say the sound, say the words out loud. Let's look at some more examples. The sounds again. Eh. Eh. Ah. Ah. Flesh. Flesh. Flash. Flash. Mary. 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 Said. Said. Sad. Sad. Shell. Shell. Shall. Shall. Guess. Guess. Gas. Gas. Kettle. Kettle. Cattle. Cattle. Jam. 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 Head. Head. Hard. Hard. Dead. Dead. Dad. Dad. And the last words are bend. Bend. Band. Band. Now let's look at some of these words in sentences. Eh. Ah, good. Okay. I'll take the sentences slowly. Then you repeat after me. And we'll do the exercise together. What are we to do? We have to point out, we have to bring out the words that have the sounds E eh and A. Ah. Okay, now the first sentence. Let's take it slowly. I bet you just bought the bag and haven't slept yet i bet you just bought the bag and haven't slept yet let's pick out the words with the sounds e eh and ah okay i bet bet what sound can you hear there Eh, okay. Eh, bet you just bought the, the, the week from the bag. Bag has the sound. Ah, bag. You have ah, ah, bag. And, and, now this is, if it's a strong form, you have the a sound. But here we are using the weak form, so we take the schwa, uh. So you say, bag and, bag and, bag and, and, not and. But if it's a strong form, you use a, but the weak form, you use the schwa, uh, okay? So we don't have the a sound here. We only have the schwa here. Haven't. 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 What sound can you hear? Ha. A. Good. So we have this sound. A. Haven't. Slept. Slept. You hear the sound. E. Yet. Yet. You. E. Yet. Good. So in this sentence, you have bet, slept, and yet, having the sound, a, they have the a sound, and words like bag, haven't, have the sound, a. I hope you're following. Good. Now let's look at the second sentence. Let's take it slowly. The man spends 10 dollars 
a day on a new sack. The man spends ten dollars a day on a new sack. Let's pick out the words with the vowels e and a. Let's begin. The man. That's the sound. A man spends. What sound? Spend a. Eh, spends. Ten a eh, a. Eh, ten dollars a day. A day a eh, a day. That's a diff song. So not a eh, day on a new sack. We have the a ah sound. So easy. So in this sentence, man and sack makes the sound a. Ah. Then a eh and um, spends and ten have the a eh sound. Good. I'll be following. Okay, let's look at the last sentence. Let's take it slowly now. Are you with me? Good. The red bag fell on the dead rat on the bed. What a sentence. The red bag fell on the dead rat on the bed. Hmm. Well, let's pick out the words with a eh and a. Ah. Let's begin. The red we have the s sound here red a bag a good fell what sound does this word have fell it has an s sound on the dead dead the ed so we have the s sound okay good rats R -a -t. That means we have the A on the bed. A. Good. So we, um, words like red, fell, dead, and bed have the E sound. And words like bag and rat have the A sound. So we've, um, we've contrasted the sounds E and a ah. take notes a eh, and a ah. don't forget i said what you have to do is to exaggerate the sounds until you can consistently produce them so go over the lesson listen watch and i have done a previous lesson where i contrasted e and a eh. i wanted to follow this series of vars pronunciation lesson if you like this video do well to share this video and press the like button. Give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do. And follow me also on other social media platforms. Our next lesson, we'll be looking at two different but similar vowel sounds. So stay in touch and wait for the next lesson. Till we meet again, stay safe. Bye for now.